do not come down to earth just yet. I will be unboxing this starship from the Guardians of the Galaxy. Well, half of them for now. You guys stay tuned. It is Kingdom Time. A miracle to be here today. Welcome back. This is Kingdom Corn. The kingdom is now officially lit. Thank you guys for clicking on my video. If you like it, please subscribe and hit that like button, support my channel. Now, please don't consider this clickbait, but today I am only going to unbox half of the Guardian ship because the other three have not been fully released yet. We are still waiting on Groot to actually be released. So for this video, I'm going to only be putting together half of the Guardian ship, which will consist of this Mantis. That will also consist of the Star-Lord, been out for a while, and Drax. Yeah, so today I'm going to put together those three because they make up one half of the ship. As for Rocket and Gamora, these two will come at another video as soon as they release that group. I promise y'all. <laughs> so for now, those guys are here just for decoration. It is time to get lit up in here. We are ready. And now Drax. And last, Mantis. I like to say that with an accent. Mantis. If you ain't saying that with an accent, you might be a regular, normal person that's not crazy like me. <laughs> okay, here they are outside of the bat, I mean, of the box. Sorry, God, I stutter. <laughs> there he is, Drax. I'm not quite sure why his eyes are closed. Maybe he is trying to just stand perfectly still so that he can be invisible to you guys. We all see him, though. Up here on a bigger piece is Mantis. She's got her antennas, wearing her green outfit from the movie. And there is Chris Pratt Star-Lord. It is kind of crazy to me that these Funkos, though so simple, they really do resemble. Like I can go to a store, look at the Funko without reading it and just know exactly who these characters are. This is one of those figures. I don't need the box to know that that is Chris Pratt Star-Lord. <laughs> this is pretty coolly detailed. You can see all sides of this ship. It is crazy how Funko, once again, can be so simple and yet so detailed at the same time. I love all the tattoos and markings on this Drax. There's all type of crooks and crevices all here on the inside of the chair. And the bobblehead feature should make pretty interesting if you decide to like fly these through the air after you put the ship together. <laughs> And here is the Mantis. She has like green streaks in her hair. I'm not quite actually sure if she has that in the movie. I don't really pay attention like that to those type of things. On her antennas, I like how they included some color right there. She is strapped in. Once again, just like Drax, the chair that she sits on has spectacular details in them. I am in high anticipation to put these all together and make it into one big thing. And lastly is the Star Lord. Once again, he is strapped up in his seat belt. The details on the chair are highly crisp, look like metal, but I doubt that it really is seeing that it is a Funko Pop. You can see even on the bottom, they have these little pieces and parts down here that will make the ship look pretty interesting. But I'm not going to wait too much longer on this. Let's go ahead and get these things put together, y'all. <laughs> now, how exactly does this work? Hmm. Well, since this is a different piece, then it's pretty obvious this must be the front of the ship. I'm not sure why Drax would get a front seat, seeing that he's not quite 
I mean, maybe he bullied his way into the front seat, but I don't think that's very practical. <laughs> hmm. Gosh, guys, I have no clue how this fits together. There are some crevices here that... Oh, okay. There you have it. Actually, these don't actually connect. Ain't that something? Dang, you know what? For $30, I will say I kind of expected more because, like, they don't have a real connection point. I do have some tape, and hopefully that will have to just do because I really don't want to take these apart. On the other hand, perhaps that means that in no particular order do they sit. So that way there's some customization that goes along with it. And that's a cool thing. So there is the first half of the Guardians all together on their ship. I can't wait to actually check out what the other half is gonna look like when it is fully put together. But guys, I must say, as far as the details go, with this being a Funko, this is kind of, I want to say like premium. I don't know, for a Funko, does it look premium to you guys? I mean, all these figures, they all look right. Look at the ship, y'all. I'll put it this way. I'm definitely not upset or complaining, except for the fact that they don't connect together all that great. But to me, I kind of expected a lot less looking at it through the pack, but having it in person, see, just look at the back of that chair. They really pay attention to everything. They have all got on their seat belts just to make sure if they get into a space accident that they won't be ejected into space. <laughs> so y'all, I will admit that the price on here those really got to me, but if you pay attention to when I actually opened my boxes, I got three of these on sale at a discount price, which is why I actually began to start this collection. On that note, I just got one more to go, but at $30 a piece for these, that is really kind of like the deal breaker. But once again, what you get is pretty kind of sweet to me, guys. <laughs> just depends on if it's what you want, but if these guys go on discount, I would definitely give it a thumbs up and a yes. As far as full price, that may be another story. Yeah, so that's my review, you guys. That was really nice and quick. Once again, you guys, I appreciate you guys so much for making it to the end. If you like my video, you can go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Welcome to the kingdom. <laughs> if you are subscribed, you guys stay tuned for my giveaways. I'm gonna make a separate video. I'm not gonna hide the giveaways anywhere. I'm gonna come out right and just throw it right at you. So, <laughs> thank you guys so much for your support. This is Kingdom Corn. You guys stay great and awesome. <laughs>